Okay, to set up your Discord, um, to be set up with your stream, um, there's several easy steps. You bring up your Discord, and you choose what channel it is that you would like your um, viewers to go into. Most generally, it'll be a general audio channel, or if you don't want them to be able to get into um, directly into an audio channel, if you want them to just be able to chat, then uh, you'll give them a, a link to your general chat channel. Either way, the same steps will apply. But you go to um, your general audio or um, text channel. In this case, I'm going to set it up for a text. And you click on Create an Instant Invite. And you click on the little icon. And instead of just copying this link, you're going because it says right here your invite link expires in one day that's no good for um, the actual link here so you're going to want to click on edit invite link and that's where you're going to want to change the link to no limit um, and expires never and you generate a new link and this is the link you're going to want you right click on it copy that link and then you go back to your stream page or if you're going to put that link over here I'm going to put it in the stream page um, edit panels create a new panel um, then you're going to add the image links to and you're going to paste that link right here and the reason why I'm pasting the link first is so if I copy and paste or anything I won't lose it now I'm going to find an image so we will go to um, Google and find a Discord. Let's grab this one right here. We will save image as. And we'll give it the name of Discord. Saved in downloads. We'll save that. Add image. We'll go to Downloads, Discord Image. We'll place the whole thing in there. Hit Done. Submit the new link and let's have a look. And there's our new Discord. And if we click click it the link will be active and that's all there is of course you can move your panels around and whatever and if you ever need that link you can always um, reactivate it and grab this link here if you want to use it into your um, bot or anything else you need to use that for so that's how you include your discord um, channel into your twitch page